Oh boy, a lot of encoding overloads today for some reason. That's fun. Love when that happens. Do doesn't drive me crazy at all. Hey, how you doing? It's me, the Dustin. Got some Spyro. Gotta do the right audio device because for some reason it clicks. Yep. Actually, the right game. Hey, Miles. So yeah, I haven't been streaming lately because I've been sick. If you watched my Mario vs. Donkey Kong, you'll know that I have been sick. I'm still a little sick, but I'm not as sick as I was. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, I think we're good to move on. We're going to the home turf of the Nork man, who has been honestly kind of a complete non-presence in this game. Up until very recently. Now where, where the heck is this? I mean, I guess we can't all be Gruntilda. I need to find the hot air balloon guy. Oh, he's over there. How do I get over there? No, no malware bites. I don't want your 50% off plus bundle. Please do not, please do not make pop-ups without my consent. Thank you. Mm, yes, random pop-ups. A completely non-malware thing to do. Oh, it was just, it was just to the left. Somehow I didn't see it. Okay, Nasty's World. Is that his first name? First name Nasty, last name Nork? Is that what's on his birth certificate? Nasty's World is a fetish website from 1999. Hey, Isaac. Why don't I have health? What, what? Oh, I guess I got hit at some point. I was like, I didn't get hit. And then I'm like, no, no, I very much got hit. Delbin. Hey, didn't I already free you? You're in Nasty's World now, Spyro. And you are the dragon who must defeat him. Bring him on! I'm ready! Reach the exit in each of Nasty's Hello, lands. Philip. Then you can challenge the Nork himself. Okay, so there's like some sort of level in here. Nork Cove. Okay, well let's check it out. What's in the Nork Cove? Nork. Sorry for spinning so much. Oh my god, it's Donkey Kong. Ow. Hang on, I want to see something real quick, actually. Okay, so testing, te testing. Volume. Check. 
Yeah. Yeah. Meanwhile, this guy's going. Oh, wow, I can do that. Oh, okay. So there's there's barrel. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I want with this, but it's there. I can kill a man. Which is always my favorite thing to do. You know, this place is pretty jolly for uh, a final set of levels. Like, this place ain't half bad. Kinda nice, actually. There's a rat on a hill. Barrels in video games serve no meaningful purpose besides hurting others. Not true. Sometimes gorillas fly out of them. You know, the naturally occurring nature barrels. Ow. <laughs> I mean, whatever. But yes, it truly is a Donkey Kong type moment. I'm not over there anymore, buddy. Believe it or not, this place is OSHA compliant. Latif. The good work, Spyro. I expect Nasty's really starting to worry about you. I'd be shaking in my Nork boots if I were him. Okay, Spyro, don't oversell it. Oh, oh. Uh, uh. Yeah, exactly. What a smug little bastard. Yep, the textures be warping. This is this do be a PS1 game. That much we can say for sure. Your texture's always warping. I love it. I didn't even need to blow that guy up. Okay, I'm going to take a risk here, but I see that chest. Okay, yeah, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Wait, did I need that guy to be here, or is it that? Maybe it's that. I'm gonna hope it's that. Hope and pray. But I mean, if I'm... If, if I can't figure out how to open it, I have an idea. Ow. Okay. Trying to see if there's like a center camera button. I guess this is the, the closest thing. Oh, no, don't roll off into the edge. You know, I feel like, you know, there, there it might have been more appropriate to look for the center camera button, you know, like several hours earlier into the game, but, you know, better Nate than Lever. I 
I'm embarrassed to say I can't tell how the game tracks your health. It's the dragonfly. The dragonfly behind you, it changes color when you get hit. And then if I kill these uh, rats, it eats the bug and it recovers. You know, it's one of them immersive health bars, you know. One of them... What's the word? Diegetic? One of them diegetic health bars? Though, to tell you the truth, I might have just preferred a regular health bar. Ah, yes, combo. Oh, well, okay, I still got him, though. No. <clears throat> Wow! I never thought I'd be rescued, especially by such a little dragon. Uh, what I mean is, I always believed in you, Spyro. You gotta believe! <laughs> is that a... Is, is that a Parappa reference? Because it... It sounds like the thing I always <laughs> I always say when I'm referencing the SpongeBob movie. Hmm. I mean, this is more of a level than I expected. Pretty large. There was a missed opportunity that Spyro didn't get a cartoon in the 90s. I mean, Crash didn't either. And believe me, I'm pretty sure they tried. Either that or the original game was gonna have an animated opening. I never remember what the actual intention was. Yeah, give me all that. But it opens up a little bit right here. Okay, there's key. Animated opening ending. Oh, okay. Okay. I believe that. It would have been cool if Crash had an animated opening, but you know. You know. Vertex lighting. Vertex lighting. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this right here while all this is going on. Um, that- that seems dangerous. He doesn't even care. He doesn't even care that I'm getting into mischief over here. How do they cross that? I mean, like, I'm a dragon, I can hover. They're getting paid minimum wage. Oh. Nasty Nork. I didn't know he was that nasty. Okay, I mean, that seems like everything. Let's see. Yep. Well, of course, that's the point of armor. Okay, yeah, give me all that good stuff. Just to be sure, let's save the game. You know, just why not? Just save it. Save it good. 
Twilight Harbor. Still a better love story. Nah, I won't. I won't say that. I won't go there. That meme is like 40 years old. Oh, oh did that dude just has a shotgun! Nasty is done fucking around. <laughs> we are done. We are done messing around. Grenades, shotgun. Oh, okay. This is not going well. Yeah, knife. Yeah, yeah, that's. Yeah, don't do that. He has firearms, but I still have fire and arms. Hmm, what do I do about this guy? Oh, just that. You know, the same old thing. Just do it better. Just, just don't mess it up this time, idiot. Now, I see that over there. You know, the levels in this game are pretty small, but I gotta say, there is- Oh my god! There is a lot of them. Like, this is- this is a game with a lot of levels in it. Man, Shadow the Hedgehog thought it was being slick. Turns out Spyro had already done it. Cosmos. Thank you for releasing me. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm pretty sure they're repeat dragons at this point. I mean, Spyro even said to one of them, didn't I already rescue you? But I'm sure it's been happening more than he has let on. Stop throwing grenade at me. I mean, there was some, like, kind of casual racism going on in the intro, I feel like. I don't know, I, I get the vibe that the, these dragons might not be such great people. They might be putting the, uh, the norks down. Re repressing them. Oppressing them. And other such pressing verbs. Okay, I can do that. But there was like a... There's like a chest back here that I couldn't open. But yeah, I can... I can do the drawbridge, I guess. I don't know why. I'm not sure why I did that. Oh, yep, 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 yep. I see what I gotta do now. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, I definitely rescued Cletus. Be on the lookout for Nort Commando, Spyro. They better be on the lookout for me. They're trapped in here with me. Yeah, double digit lives. But yeah, they, they want you to go through here and like, ow, not that. They don't want you to do that. But yeah, you want to go down there all the way back to this chest. Yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad I didn't try to do this last stream because this is, this is substantial content.
Okay, need to get that chest. Herp. Herp. Hey, I lost it. What gives? You can lower the drawbridge to true. True. I mean, I didn't know that, but I had a feeling. <laughs> probably would simplify things. Yeah, roadkill. Yeah, disproportionately hard gems to get. This course is kind of built like a racetrack. Ow. Now, is there any reason for me to have the charge through here? I mean, I haven't seen anything yet. Yeah, luckily these dudes aren't very good shots. They kind of just, you know, spray and pray. Also, sorry, you may see, you may see the lighting change on my webcam periodically. You may see Spyro fall into the pit periodically. But, but yeah, uh, one of my light bulbs is dying and I haven't had the opportunity to go get another yet. So you may see that go on and off at various points. Ow! Ow! Good thing I have 400 lives. Mm, pardon me. Dustin VG ad revenue doesn't pay enough for light bulb four pack. I mean, I have money. I just, I don't know. It felt like a waste to buy light bulbs off the internet. Like when I can just run down to my local Dollar General. This stream not sponsored by Dollar General. Dollar General has light bulbs? I think so. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm, I'm dead. <laughs> but yeah, God, I keep letting that guy kill me. Why am I the dumbest man on earth? <laughs> Got fire mist, fire mist, open fire. Yeah, you just gotta, you gotta be, you gotta be ready. You just gotta get them. Okay. And that's the end of the level. Because of course it is. Did I get all the gems? Yes. How about the dragons? Yes. Okay. We. But yeah, I do tend to prefer Dollar General over going to Walmart. I will say that much. I don't know. Some about some about Dollar General just feels like there's less pressure. Walmart, it feels like you're watch walking into. The Orc's Fortress.
nasty no oh that's that's just it's just him there so i guess this is the bonus level hallmark feels like nasty's world yeah exactly i hate walmart because they play really loud pop music oh Okay, so he's just gonna fire at me while I'm doing all this. But... I have reason. Okay, I need to get the running, man. It is imperative. It, it actually is imperative. Like, this is not... This is not an optional running, man. This is very mandatory. running mandatory. Yeah, I walked into that one, I suppose. Now what you got? Wait, did I miss that? So I definitely want these gems. I've gotten... I've gotten enough of these gems already. Oh, he's all the way over there. Oh, hold on there, sport. Don't, don't get your panties in a twist. Jumping up the slopes helps a lot. Get back here. Get back here. Reminds you of the Grinch. Everything reminds you of the Grinch, Miles. <laughs> that is true. I mean, The Grinch was a pretty cool game from what I... I mean, from what I played of it, I played the whole thing. <laughs> Dreamcast version, maybe not ideal, though. Oh, he, he's a running man. He's the final running man. Oh, that was risky. Risky business. I really should not have done that. Or maybe I should have, I don't know.
Oh yeah, you just you just gotta do that. Just gotta do that at him. Oh no, it's slowly going into the wall, I think, maybe. Whoa. Whoa, Nelly. Okay, now it's getting a little precarious. Don't worry, though, I'm fine. Black. Sorry I took so long. I kind of forgot about you. What about Ganasty Ganork? Nasty Nork? His toast! So now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Well, mostly. I've still got some treasure to pick up. What will you do next? I'd say the sky's the limit. I'm going to Escalator Land! But yes, a very, very fun, very goofy video game. Does not, does not take itself seriously in the slightest. Mark Cerny. Stuart Copeland. Yeah, Clancy Brown. Carlos. Michael. Jamie. Michael again. Yeah, it's Carlos. Gollum. Derek Power. You wish your last name was Power. No sheep were harmed during the creation of this game. They were harmed after the game was created. A few norks, but no sheep. But yes, we're not quite done yet. Nasty's ancient history now. So, what's in there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard. But the gate will not open until you have found everything in the Dragon Kingdom. Come back when you have reached 100 When you're a little, mmm, richer. Oh, and then yeah, it, it's open now. <laughs> <laughs> So let's see, Nasty's loot. Oh, it's a flying level. No time limit, but it's a flying level. Where am I going? 
Okay, I flew through all that. Oh, Spyro can't fly any higher than this, though. There's a height limit. Oh, yes, we're going to receive major inflation here. The economy will never be the same. You couldn't rename the Spyro OST vari variations on the Amanda Show theme. Yeah. I haven't listened to a ton of this dude's music, but I will say that this game does not paint a good picture of his range. <laughs> Yeah, and you gotta find keys. I don't know how old the keys are, but you gotta find them anyway. Yeah, the ridiculous amounts of money. Or at least jewels. I don't know. These jewels might be worth nothing. Honestly, I'd, I'd imagine they'd be worth nothing because there's so many of them. Like, if you look around, these things are everywhere. It doesn't speak well for their value. Oh, I've released the plane. Okay, nope. I find nickels on the ground sometimes, but U.S. currency still has value. Well, yes, but it, it, there's a difference between sometimes and every three seconds. Like, we're talking you can't walk three feet without tripping over a nickel. I guess it'd be kind of embarrassing if you tripped on a nickel, though. I need more height. How do I gain more height? Wear taller shoes. Good idea. I'm just... Because it's like it's based on where you jump off from. Like... The place where you start flying is the highest place you can... you can go. So I'm trying to find a higher ledge to jump off of. It's actually based on how many doors you unlock. Oh. Okay. That... that's very... Intuitive. 
So I'm guessing I need to wait till this guy gets down lower. Gotta wait till Sh Shawty gets low. Come on, come on, get close. Get closer to me. There we go. Honestly, I'm not sure if I'm disappointed or relieved that the bonus level is just sort of a final victory lap. Part of me was expecting like Champions Road, but I guess Spyro, that's not how Spyro wants to play. very breezy game overall true spyro never really gets all that difficult okay just gotta just gotta gain on this guy a little bit i mean i could try going in the other direction but i'm scared he'd turn around Oh, I'm close. I'm gaining. I'm gaining. Come on. Come on, get get fired. Airplane dude, you fired. Your boss is dead. I killed him. There's no one to sign your paycheck anymore. But it was minimum wage anyway, so... Now where's that last door? Hang on, I'll find it. It's around here someplace. Maybe in here? Oh yeah, that, that's where it was. Okay. Saturn in the sky. Oh man. Oh. Oh, look at this. Yeah, yeah. really is like just a ton of money like more this might be more money than like every other level in the game combined well maybe not that much but it, it it's got to be close is there nothing hidden behind the portrait two thousand i thought it was gonna be 1999 i don't know why 
Let's see, Saturn. Where's Saturn? I see a polygon. Well, either way, let's go. Spyro the dragon, you've defeated Ganasty Ganork, collected the dragon eggs, saved all the dragons, and recovered every bit of treasure in the Dragon Kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob. And I'm happy for the dragon world, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with Nasty Nork and his weird minions. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say. <laughs> For every good battle, you need a What's good a minion? adversary. Uh, I never mind. Nasty, in spite of his misguided nature, was a worthy opponent. Uh-oh. Here we go again. And we're gonna watch the credits again. But yeah, I had some good fun with this. Enjoyed. Big enjoy. Thumb, thumbs up. Uh, there's two more of these on the PS1 that I'll get to at some point. But yeah, not, I mean, there's not too much to say, you know, just, just a charming, charming little fifth gen platformer. What's next on your two playlist? You know, actually, I don't know. I mean, next stream, two and three are even better than this. Good to hear. Uh, next stream is going to be probably finishing up Mario versus Donkey Kong. But after that, I don't know. It might be time for another questionnaire. But, uh, I mean, I'm probably gonna play Princess Peach Showtime, but they, we got a little while before that comes out. So, I mean, if you got any suggestions, let me know. You know, we got... We've got stuff like Wario Land 2, I've thought about. At some point, I'm going to play Majora's Mask. Uh, what else? Pac-Man World is still on the docket. Though, honestly, it feels a little faux pas to play another PS1 platformer right after this one. Uh, Mario 64 DS, I've thought about. Like I said, though, I'll, I'll take suggestions if you got any. I mean, hey, I'm not going to I'm not going to complain. I just say it. I just saying, you know, to mix it up a little bit, get some variety in there, but So I don't, do the dragon eggs hatch at any point? Do I get to see that? I, I reckon not. So yeah, I'm guessing there's nothing more to really see here. 120%. Seems a little inflated, but you know, I'll take it. <laughs> I mean, look, like I said, if if the viewers don't mind then I, I don't mind either, you know, it's not, I'm not going to say like, wrong, wrong, well, maybe I'll say that sometimes. But yeah, that only took about an hour, so I might load up Spelunky too. <laughs> Raiding his bank account. True.
Yeah, I think I'll I'll load up Spelunky two to pad out the rest of the stream. Let me stop the recording here to make it easier to upload.